I look at the minus 120, and I think that is a no-brainer. The Boston Bruins, minus 120. I actually think that the Bruins could win this in five or in six. And when I look at the odds for the Bruins to win in five at plus 540 and the Bruins to win in six at plus 520, I would sprinkle on both those options because I don't think the Leafs are going to win that series, and I don't think it goes past six games. So I'm looking at Boston in five, Boston in six as great value right there. But if you just want to play safe and you just want to look at maybe doubling up your money, uh, minus 120 for the Boston Bruins to win the series is, for me, the bet to make. I'm not saying defense wins championship or wins one round, but it's clearly a mismatch for the Toronto Maple Leafs to go your blue line against the Boston Bruins blue line when you have McAvoy and Lindholm and, and, and you have so much depth on the Boston Bruins blue line and in that. I mean, Lena Solmark won a Vesna Trophy last year, and he's not technically the number one guy. Like, they have Swayman, but I don't think they'll make the same mistake they did last year where they waited until Game 7 to throw Jeremy Swayman in. I think Swayman possibly starts Game 1, and then Allmark could come in at any moment. So that alone, the blue line and the crease, I think gives a massive edge to the Boston Bruins.